Hello, my name is Ruth, and I would like to help you learn new words in English. Join me next for Hello Word Power on Hello Channel. This is Hello Channel. Hello, welcome to Hello Word Power. My name is Ruth. Today we're learning words in English that teach us all about the places we might visit in our neighborhood. Are you ready? Let's begin. City. City. Now you say it. City. Yes, say it again. City. One more time. City. Yes, that's right, city. Do you live in a city? A city is a large settlement of people, buildings, stores, and businesses all in the same location. A city is usually a large settlement with many thousand people. The city of London is the largest city in the United Kingdom. Say it again, city. Yes, that's right. Town, town, town. Now you say it, town. Again, town. Yes, once more, town. That's correct. A town is smaller than a city. A town is a group of houses, buildings, and businesses all located in the same geographic area. Every year, the people of the town have a party in the town square. Say it again, town. Yes, that's right. Village, village, village. Now you say it, village. Again, village. Yes, once more, village. That's correct. A village is smaller than a city and smaller than a town. A village is a group of houses and associated buildings usually situated in a rural area. The farming village is 10 kilometers from the closest town. Say it again, village. Yes, that's right, well done. Library, library, library. Now you say it, library. Try it again, library. One more time, library. Yes, that's right. A library is a building or room that contains books, magazines, newspapers, recorded movies, and recorded music for people to read, borrow, or look at. I stop at the library each week to borrow books to read. Say it again, library. Yes, that's right. Grocery store. Grocery store. That's two words, grocery store. Now you say it, grocery store. Again, grocery store. One more time, grocery store. Yes, that's right. A grocery store is a place where you can buy meat, fruit, vegetables, bread, other food, and small household items. A grocery store is also called a market, or if it is very large, it is called a supermarket. Say it again, grocery store. Yes, that's right. Open air market. This is three words, open air market. Now you say it, open air market. Again, open air market. One more time, open air market. Yes, that's right. An open air market is an outdoor market where you are in the open air. Different vendors sell food, clothing, gifts, and other small items at an open air market. Many tourists go to the open air market to buy local products. Say it again open air market. Yes, that's right. 
We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Learn English and have fun. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Shopping mall. Shopping mall. Shopping mall. That's two words. Now you say it. Shopping mall. Again, shopping mall. One more time. Shopping mall. Yes, that's right. A shopping mall is a large building or series of connected buildings containing a variety of retail stores. Some shopping malls are indoor malls. Other malls are outdoor shopping malls. Often, there are several restaurants that are also part of a shopping mall. My mother does all of our family shopping at one shopping mall. Say it one more time, shopping mall. Yes, well done. Fire station. Fire station. Fire station. You try it. Fire station. Yes, again, fire station. One more time. Fire station. Yes, that's correct. A fire station is a building where firefighters live and stand ready to respond quickly should a fire break out somewhere in the area. Fire trucks, big hoses, and ladders are also kept at the fire station so the firefighters are prepared for any emergency fires. When my house caught fire, I immediately called the fire station. Say it one more time, fire station. Correct. Police station. Two words again, police station. You say it, police station. Again, police station. Yes, that's right. A police station is a building that is the headquarters for law enforcement in a town or a city. Police cars, police officers, and a small jail cell can also be found at the police station. After catching the thief, the police officers took the robber to the police station. Say it again, police station. Correct. Doctor's office. Two words, doctor's office. Now you try it, doctor's office. Again, doctor's office. Yes, that's right. A doctor's office is a building or a room where doctors examine and care for their medical patients. When you are sick, you should go to the doctor's office. Say it again, doctor's office. Yes, that's right. Dentist office, dentist office. Two words, once again, say dentist office. Please repeat, dentist office. One more time, dentist office. Yes, that's right. A dentist's office is a building or a room where a dentist cares for patient's teeth. Fred has a toothache so he will go to the dentist's office. Say it again, dentist's office. Correct. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Hey mom, why don't we all go rollerblading tonight? Uh, not tonight, honey. Mom. Spending time with me now means having a better chance of being close to me when I'm a teenager. How are you going to deal with that if we're not close? Give your family everything. Give them your time from The Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. For a brighter future, just say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. 
Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Hospital. Hos p i t a l Hospital. Now you try it. Hospital. Again, hospital. One more time. Hospital. Yes, that's right. A hospital is a place where surgical and medical treatment is given. Nurses and doctors care for sick or injured patients who come to the hospital. Susan will deliver her baby at the local hospital. Say it again hospital. Yes, that's right. Airport. 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 Now you say it. Airport. Again, airport. Yes, once more. Airport. Very well done. An airport is located in every major city in the world. It is the location where private and commercial airplanes take off and land throughout the day and night, taking people to many other places around the globe. We will meet at the airport two hours before our flight leaves. Say it again airport. Yes, correct. Bank. B a n k Bank. Now you say it. Bank. Again, bank. Yes, once more. Bank. That's right. A bank is a business, usually in a building. People go to the bank to take care of their financial transactions. You can borrow money from a bank. You can put money into a bank account, and you can use many different banking services. Each payday, Mark goes to the bank to deposit his paycheck. Say it again bank. Correct. Gymnasium. Gym. Gymnasium. Gymnasium. Now you say it. Gymnasium. Again, gymnasium. Once more, gymnasium. Yes, that's right. The word gymnasium is often shortened to gym. Gym. A gym or gymnasium is a building. Usually large in size, where people go to exercise and stay healthy and fit. I go to the gym each morning to exercise. Say gym. And now say gymnasium. Well done. Florist shop. This is two words. Florist shop. Now you say it. Florist shop. Again. Florist shop. Once more. Florist shop. Yes, that's right. A florist shop is a flower store. In a florist shop, fresh flowers are cut, arranged, and sold. Brian plans to stop on his way home and purchase some flowers for his wife at the florist shop. Say it again. Florist shop. Yes, correct. School. 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 You try it. School. Again, school. Once more, school. Yes, well done. A school is a building in a city or town where students come to take classes and get an education. Children start going to school at a very young age and are required to attend school until they are young adults. My favorite subject at school is learning English. Say it again school. Well done. College. 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 You say it college. Again, college. One more time. College. Yes, that's right. A college is an educational institution dedicated to provide higher education, professional training, or vocational training. 
Jack attends college to learn computer technology. Say it again, college. Yes, that's right. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Learning English may be the biggest factor in the jobs you can get and the money you can earn. Hi, I'm Michelle, and I want to tell you about Hello Channel, an exciting new channel that teaches you English as you're watching TV. As you watch Hello Channel, you'll see, read, hear, and speak English, and before you know it, you'll be on your way to a better job and a brighter future. All you have to do is say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. University. 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 Now you say it. University. Again, university. Once more, university. Yes, that's right. A university is a building or a group of buildings that make up an educational institution designed to teach students in many areas of advanced learning. Peter will attend the university to become a teacher. Say it again, university. Yes, correct. Bakery, bakery, bakery. Now you say it, bakery. Again, bakery. One more time, bakery. Yes, correct. A bakery is a shop or business that sells freshly baked food items. You can buy bread, buns, pastries, tarts, cakes, and other delicious food at the bakery. The person who prepares the food items is the baker. Each morning, I like to buy fresh bread at the bakery. Say it again, bakery. Yes, correct. Office building. Two words, office building. Now you say it, office building. Again, office building. One more time, office building. Yes, that's right. Office buildings can come in many different shapes and sizes. They are buildings where businesses and companies do commercial, professional, or governmental work. Maria works in the office building on Main Street. Say it again, office building. Yes, correct. Sky, scraper, sky, Scraper. Skyscraper. Now you say it. Skyscraper. Try again. Sky. Scraper. Once more. Skyscraper. Yes, that's right. A skyscraper is a tall, tall building, usually in a large city. These buildings were constructed with so many floors, they were said to scrape the sky. Companies and businesses often have their offices on different levels of a skyscraper. We can ride the elevator to the top of the skyscraper. Say it again, skyscraper. Correct. Church. 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 Now you say it. Church. Yes, again. Church. One more time. Church. Correct. A church is a building that is used for religious worship. In any city or town, you will likely find several churches of different religions. The family attends church every Sunday. Say it again church. Yes, correct. Zoo. 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 Now you say it. Zoo. 
Again, zoo. One more time, zoo. That is correct. A zoo is an establishment that maintains a collection of wild animals, typically in a park or a garden setting. People visit the zoo for enjoyment, for study, and observation. John likes to watch the polar bears at the zoo. Say it again, zoo. Correct. Museum. 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 You try it. Museum. Again, museum. Once more, museum. Yes, that's right. A museum is a building in which objects of historical, scientific, artistic, or cultural significance are stored, studied, and exhibited. Amy saw a painting by Leonardo da Vinci at the museum. Say it again, museum. Correct. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. We learned English. Your kids can too. Just watch Hello Channel. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Nursery. 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 Now you say it. Nursery. Again, nursery. Yes, one more time. Nursery. Correct. A nursery is a business that sells all types of plants, flowers, trees, and greenery to the public. As a garden store, nurseries also sell things such as water hoses, fertilizer, seeds, and tools needed to grow a garden. Say it again, nursery. Yes, correct. Hardware store. Two words here. Hardware store. Hardware store. Now you say it. Hardware store. Again, hardware store. One more time. Hardware store. Yes, that's right. A hardware store. A hardware store is a store that sells tools, machinery, wood, and other materials needed to repair things or build things. Rob ran out of nails, so he went back to the hardware store to buy some more. Say it again, hardware store. Yes, that's right. Concert hall. Two words, concert hall. Concert hall. You say it, concert hall. Again, concert hall. One more time, concert hall. Yes, that's correct. A concert hall is a specially constructed building with outstanding acoustics for the purpose of providing a place to perform high quality concerts and productions. Many large cities have one or more outstanding concert halls. The violinist's dream was to one day play at Carnegie Hall in New York City one of the world's most famous concert halls. Say it again, concert hall. Yes, correct. Stadium, stay, d, um. Stadium, you try it, stadium. Again, stadium. One more time, stadium. That's right. A stadium is an arena where thousands of people can gather for sporting events, musical concerts, political speeches, and other community events. Everyone in the town will go to the football stadium to watch the championship game. Say it again, stadium. Correct. 
bus terminal. Bus terminal. Two words. Bus terminal. Now you say it. Bus terminal. Again, bus terminal. One more time. Bus terminal. Yes, that's right. A bus terminal is a transportation hub where buses are housed, maintained, and from which they depart on their bus routes. Some buses travel around a town or around a city. Other buses travel great distances around the country. The friends will meet at the bus terminal one hour before their bus leaves for Mexico City. Say it again, bus terminal. That's right. Train station. This has two words, train, station. You say it, train station. Again, train station. Yes, that's right. A train station is another type of transportation hub. Trains arrive and depart from train stations during the day and the night all around the world. Jane arrives at the train station 20 minutes before her husband's train is scheduled to arrive. Say it again, train station. Yes, good job. Well done. You did very well today. Now you've learned to say some of the places you visit in your city or town all in English. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time for more Hello Word Power.